What's going on? It's your friend Jack here, and today we're going to be taking a look at this new Redbubble Chrome extension that I actually think is very useful. And if you use it, you can definitely upload way, way faster to your Redbubble shops and get a list of good tags at the same time to speed up your Redbubble uploads 99%. All right, so as you may or may not know, you do need good tags to get, you know, sales, to get traffic to your listings, and you want those tags to not only be relevant, but you want them to be somewhat popular in the sense that people are actually searching for those tags. A lot of this has to do with the niche you choose to make your design in. However, this tool right here is going to generate some best-selling tags based on the tag you initially give it and you can do it while you're uploading. So you don't have to open a new tab, you don't have to do anything, you can do it all in the same tab of your upload tab and it's gonna let you upload a lot, lot faster and not only because, you know, you can grab the tags right on the page but because you don't have to go elsewhere, you don't have to open up a new tab, you don't have to change tabs, you don't have to do a lot of things and it's also gonna be able to make you more sales because now if you're not already using a tag generation tool, you're going to be able to generate tags that are going to be able to help your listings get seen and actually get some traffic to your listings, some eyeballs on those listings. With that being said though, let's take a look at the tool in action over on my Redbubble shop. So once you get to your listing, you're going to upload your image and I uploaded my amazing face, uh, but obviously you probably want to upload a design that people want to buy, not just your face. However, if people do like your face, go ahead, more the power to you. But Let's go talk about how you can use this tool. So all you gotta do, go to the top right here, and you wanna click on the tool we just added to Chrome. The page we were just looking at was the Chrome page. I'll link it down in the description, but you wanna click on this. And after you click on this, you can type your keyword that you wanna basically generate the tags from, and you'll get relevant keywords towards that, as much as this tool can generate algorithmically, um, but it's not always the most accurate. So also copy these tags with your discretion. There's an import to rebel button too, but you can just grab tags and copy them manually and then paste them over all in the same tab. So with that being said, we're going to go as if this design is a, you know, a cute kid. Okay. I'm a cute kid. I know that's weird, but that's, we're going to, we're going to target. That's our target audience. All right. Uh, funny kids. It's going to be something for like parents. Let's say it's a design for parents. Now what we do is we type over here the main keyword, which is parents. And after you type in the keyword, you click grab tags and it's going to load for a sec. It takes two seconds. And right here we got parents, funny, mom, cute, parent, baby, mama bear, which is a little bit of a niche down parent word in a niche in itself. So also gives you niche ideas cow um cow parent kids family children mother mothers they love dog so these aren't all amazing right you got to keep in mind we did something very general just parents so if you want to do parents uh parents helper like something very niche down it might not even get a full list of tags but you look up something a bit more niche down now you have kids girls women's brothers youth gag men toddler boys so you get ideas and these are very generic still, but a lot of the times when I'm in a specific niche, let's say for example, we go into the pickleball niche because everyone likes pickleball, the pickleball niche. When you look for a niche down uh, tag generation, you can generate some tags that are actually really good, especially if you already have your niche down right here. Pickleball, pickleball, baseball, dink, funny, pickleball, retirement, pickleball player, Paddle, so tennis, pickleball paddle, dinking. Dinking is a term in pickleball. If you didn't know that, this this tool would have gave you the tags for it. So the good thing about this tool is that it's gonna search, you know, listings that are already selling or appearing high in search results for these keywords. And those are appearing high in search results because they're using words that not only are directly or associated with the niche, but you'd have to know a little bit about pickleball to know the term dink or dinking, right? So obviously, if you looked at pickleball real quick, you could tell that something there's something to do with dinking and dink that has to do with pickleball. But this tool is also going to give you keyword ideas and things you wouldn't have thought of a lot of the time if you're not experienced in a niche or you're not that knowledgeable about a niche that you are designing for. And that itself is valuable. So after you're done, you can just click Control A 
and control C to manually copy them or you can click this import the red bubble button. I just copy them and then you can paste them over. Usually I would not use all of them. I would use somewhere between 10 to 20 tags. That's my sweet spot. But um, you know, anything more than five, just get above the five uh, tag limit, I would say, and try to get towards 10 to 20. That's gonna be a little bit more data for Redbubble to pull uh, for your design. And keep in mind, sometimes, uh, you know, Redbubble t tool generations are gonna add a product type to the end of these tags because they're just pulling uh, from all the tags on the Redbubble searches. This tool does not pull product tags. It does not pull the t-shirt, the sticker, the all those keywords that you shouldn't include in your tags. For, you don't wanna put sticker or t-shirt in your tags because if you enable those products, it's gonna be automatically added to the tag section for that product, so you don't have to worry about it. Keep that in mind. You don't wanna spam the product types in the tag section on Redbubble. It's not gonna help you. If anything, Redbubble is just gonna look at you and kind of be like, what the heck is this guy doing? So yeah, I wouldn't do that. But yeah, this tool is really, really good. It's a free tool. I found out about it by someone commenting down below uh, because it actually is really useful. And I wanted to share with you guys. I figured you might as well know about this tool if I know about it. It's gonna help you upload a lot faster and it's gonna help you find tags faster. It just allows everything to get done in one place. And if you are using the copy, your copy function on your listings, so you're copying your listing settings and you're using the same dimensions for your design, then all you have to really do is upload your design, make sure it's good on everything, usually it will be, and then generate your tags is usually the longest part for me. And to be able to have this tool do it for me makes it a hundred times easier. So with all that being said, that's the whole video. A little bit of a long winded talk there, but now let's roll the outro. So the sun is shining a little bit now. And as you can see, we got some natural light in my room. And I just wanted to thank you guys for your support once again. Uh, this is going to be the second video going up today. If you missed my video earlier, it was about my KDP earnings for my third month. Surprise, surprise, it was my biggest month yet, and I uploaded nearly no books. So if you're interested in my KDP progress, go check out that video. It'll be linked probably up here in the top right and also down in the description. And if you want to use this free generation tool of tags for your Redbubble listings to upload faster and also increase your sales, then definitely go check it out. It'll be down linked in the description. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been your friend Jack. Keep striving, stay blessed. Peace out.